Arrests over the past six months are way up in many communities across southern Kentucky, including in Mount Vernon. And the Mount Vernon police chief says that this problem related to prescription drugs is coming into our area along Interstate 75. It's mind boggling. It really is. It's just Mount Vernon police chief Terry Jackson says that in his town, drug cases have tripled in the past year. In the first seven months of 2009, they've put more people in jail than in all 12 months of 2008, largely because of an increase in prescription drug abuse. A few weeks ago, during a DUI traffic stop, 300 pills were confiscated from one car. Oxycodone and Xanax are two of the more commonly abused drugs these days. Anybody can do it. Uh, they, get, they start taking prescription drugs and they get hooked on them and it tears uh, families apart. There obviously is a problem because it's a problem everywhere. Pharmacies in Kentucky are not easy places to buy if you're going to abuse because records are kept of who purchases what drugs. And on a routine basis, we have to submit that information, the patient social security number, to the state. And they keep a running track of the patients. So those who want to abuse have to look to another supply line, one that runs from south to north from Florida right through Mount Vernon. From my understanding, they're having uh, pain clinics set up in different areas of Florida where they basically you can walk in one place and walk out with the prescription drugs in the same day in pending cases but the bottles have the Florida addresses on them I mean everything's they even get business cards out to these people law enforcement tells us that they will continue to hit this problem hard on local state and federal levels reporting in Rockcastle County Jeff Cornish ABC 36 news